Good morning. Hello there. Welcome to our workout for today. I pressed the go live uh, button a little bit early, so I'm just going to give it another minute or two to make sure people are able to join me today. Uh, also, if you are here, say hi. I would love to know uh, that you're working out with me this morning. And also, give me feedback as to if I'm sounding okay, if you can hear me well, and if you can see me okay, and whether or not the orientation of the video is okay. Um, as you may know, Facebook likes to change their settings sometimes, and one week they want it this way, and another week we have to do it the opposite way. So. Um, just want to double check that my orientation is okay and that, um, that the sound is okay. So give me some feedback. Please let me know if anything is awry before I get started um, exercising with you this beautiful Saturday morning. So today, uh, today's workout is going to be in a chair. All you need is a sturdy chair and a rolled up um, a rolled up towel or a rolled up I'm using a pillowcase um, something that's kind of long that you can hold on to you don't need a lot of equipment today just a sturdy chair and a rolled up towel so super simple we're going to be exercising today for about 30 minutes or so and um, just get the weekend started off right um, getting your body moving and exercising so that you can um, have more energy and more flexibility and more strength as you um, enter the weekend. So it's going to be fun. So if you're hopping on and you've never met me before, I'm Ashley Lorch. I am a physical therapist in Rochester. I'm the owner of a physical therapy practice called Thrive Physical Therapy. And we just started doing these Saturday workouts for people who want to get moving again. The weather's changing, uh, we're coming out of hibernation, pandemic numbers are looking better, people are getting vaccinated, all of these really exciting things. So people are telling us that they're ready to start moving more. So we decided to start offering these free Saturday classes. Um, where people can jump on from the comfort and the convenience of their living rooms. You can wear pajamas if you want to. You can see me, but I can't see you. Um, so it's fun and it's, um, it's just an easy way to get moving and um, start feeling better. And then we also keep these uh, workouts posted on our Facebook page. So if you don't catch it live, you can always watch it on the replay. So I'm just gonna double check here that everything looks okay. I'm uh, definitely not the most technologically savvy person when it comes to this kind of stuff. So just give me a second and just double check here and I'm not seeing not seeing any comments so far, so maybe. I think they'll pop up if we get any. So at 1032, let's go ahead and get started with our workout today. And first thing you wanna do is just find a seat in your chair. So, sitting in your chair, nice and tall, get comfortable with your feet flat on the ground. Sitting up tall, just sort of connect to your breath for a minute here. So hands on your thighs, take a deep breath in through your nose and exhale through your mouth. So here we go, inhale through your nose and exhale, blow it out through your mouth. Let's do one more, I see a comment here. Oh, okay, <laughs> it seems that people are on, so that's awesome. So again, inhale through your nose, Exhale through your mouth, blow it all out. One more time, this time we're gonna inhale and raise our arms up overhead. And exhale, press the air down. Good, all right, so go ahead and grab your towel now if you have that available. So you're gonna hold on to your towel nice and wide here with an overhand grip. And then we're going to just push the towel forward 
and then pull those um, arms back, squeeze your shoulder blades together, and push your arms forward, squeeze those shoulder blades together. This one is really great to help with posture. And squeeze, very good. Now push, and squeeze those shoulder blades together. Push, and pull. Let's do five more just like this for five, Four, three, push, two, push, and one, push it forward. Let's go again a little bit faster this time. So, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Okay, let's move right into the next one. So with that towel again, go ahead and stretch it right up toward the ceiling, right all the way up as high as you can go, and then bring that towel down toward your lap. So push it up and big stretch. Come on back down, press up to the ceiling, nice and tall posture, and down. That was three. Push it up for four, down, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Bring it down. Let's do the same exact movement again, this time faster. Here we go. Press that towel up to the ceiling for ten, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come on down. All right, nice job. So next one, keep that towel right in your hands, and we are going to bring the towel down toward the floor. So only go as comfortable as feels good in your body. If this bothers your back at all, back off for sure. Uh, but if it feels great, you can go all the way down to the floor with that towel. Just make sure you keep your eyes right in the middle of the towel so you're not looking up and straining your neck. So, looking at the towel, you're going to hinge at your waist, reach down, come on up to your chest, nice and tall. Let's do that again. Down, two, down, three, down, four, down, for five, down, for six, down, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Nice job. Take a deep breath here. Let's go into that same movement pattern just a little bit quicker this time. So again, don't go so fast that it bothers your back or so far. Do what feels right in your body. Here we go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. All right, let's start working our core muscles a little bit here. So, feet on the floor, make sure your back is away from that backrest. If you can sit up nice and tall, just rely on your core muscles here. Really kind of pull everything in. Think that, you know, like you're wearing a corset so that your, um, your spine is really well supported here. And go ahead and take that towel again. Open up your feet a little bit wider this time. And then we're gonna reach to the right. So I'm gonna reach this way to the right and then come right back up to the middle. So a reach and kind of press that towel forward. Come on up to the middle. Again, push and one. Push for two. Reach for three. Reach four. Reach for five, reach six, reach seven, reach eight, reach nine, 
one, reach for 10. Let's go right into that other side. So I'm going toward the left and up and reach for two, reach three, reach four, five, good job, six, reach seven, press that towel for eight, reach nine, reach and ten, good, take just a minute and let those arms relax and then we're going to go right back into the same movement again a little bit faster. So here we go from the top toward the right. Press one, press two, reach three, four, five, reach six, reach for seven, eight, nine, ten to the left for one. Reach two, reach for three, four, five, this is a hard one, six, seven, almost there, eight, nine, and ten. Relax and shake it out. It might feel good for you to pull a little bit on the towel as you use it, so instead of just kind of holding it with, um, you know, having the towel be slack in the middle. It actually um, helps to activate your arm muscles if you can hold the towel, squeeze it, and then pull outward a little bit. You'll get a little bit more activation through your arm muscles that way, and it feels really good. Okay, I'm gonna catch my breath. Whew, it actually is possible to get a good workout in a chair. So, um, hopefully uh, I'm still oriented okay, I'm not seeing any feedback that I'm not oriented or that you can't hear me. So let's keep on going with our exercises today. So grab that towel again. We're going to hold it in just one hand toward, um, go ahead and maybe fold it in half and kind of hold it on the end. You don't want it too long because um, you want to whip things that might be in your vicinity. So. Um, the movement pattern that we're going to do is a diagonal reach and lowering. So just check your environment. Make sure you're not going to hit your, you know, your spouse or, or uh, knock over a lamp or anything before we do this one. So holding that towel kind of in the middle folded. And you're going to take that right arm, reach powerfully in a diagonal direction. And then kind of like you're chopping word, you're going to chop across your body and reach toward the floor on the opposite side. So down, and then reach back up. Again, reach toward the opposite foot, and reach up nice and tall. That opposite hand can be active and reaching toward the floor. You can use it to support yourself on the chair if that feels better. So come on down, keep that arm nice and strong, reach up. And down, big stretch. Reach down, and open, down. Good, and reach, stretch, reach, open. Let's go for five, four, up, three, up, two, up, last one, stretch. Switch hands, let's go right into the other side. So nice diagonal reach on the left arm up toward the ceiling. Come across your body, reach for the floor, and up, keep it going. Reach, and up. Reach to the floor for two. Reach, three, down, four, five, six, seven, down for eight, nine, and 10, bring it down. All right, let's see how we're doing on time. Let's go ahead and move into the next one, which is going to be rotating through your spine. So sitting up nice and tall, hold that towel a little bit wider this time. Do that um, engagement where you pull the towel slightly outward with your posture nice and tall, spine is long. Deep breath here, you're gonna reach and twist toward the right side. So as I twist 
through my spine. I'm also allowing my legs to come along for the ride. And then we're going to go through the middle and then twist toward the other direction. So twist and reach. Rotate around, stretch. And rotate around and stretch. Let's pick this one up a little bit. So twist for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Nice work. Come on back to the middle. All right, so let's go ahead and we're going to move down to our legs next. This workout is flying by. Um, so we're going to move down to the legs, and after we do our, our leg movements, then we'll do some stretches. So with that towel rolled up, go ahead and put it right on the floor in front of you. So my towel is in front of me. And then I'm going to put my feet right on top of that towel. So both feet are on the towel, right in the middle, next to each other. So from here, I'm going to jump my feet open and out to the edges of the towel. Or if your towel's a little bit shorter, you can go a little bit farther if you'd like to. If jumping out is not really an option for your body, you can step out with one foot and then step out with the other foot and then bring them back together. That's also completely fine. So we're going to do 10 repetitions just like that. Legs out, legs in. Go ahead and let's give it a whirl. Here we go. Four, ten. Together. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Nice job. And remember, you do not have to stay at my pace if I'm going too slow, too fast. You can definitely speed things up or slow them down as you need to, whatever feels good to you. So we're going to do the same movement pattern again, but add the arms. So as your legs go out, your arms are going to go out too. So if I'm doing the jumping version, it looks like this. And if I'm doing the stepping version, it looks like that. Let's go ahead and get 10 in here. And we're going to go a little bit faster, but again, go at your own pace. Here we go. 10, 9. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it back in. Nice job. So adjust your towel a little bit. Bring it forward maybe an inch or two. And we're going to do a similar movement, but instead of jumping out and in, we're going to go forward and back with our legs. So now the towel is right in front of my toes. And I'm going to jump over the towel and behind the towel. Brace yourself with your hands on the chair if you'd like to. Or if you're feeling really confident and want an added challenge, you can cross your arms across your chest, put them on your hips, put them out in front, wherever it feels good. So we're going over the towel and back. And again, if jumping isn't an option, just step over, over, back, back. Okay, let's go for 10 here. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Add the arms. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Excellent job. I definitely felt that one in my thighs. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to another exercise for our legs and for our core. So go ahead and pick up that towel. And we're going to do a march with a little bit of a twist through our spine. So if I lift my right leg up like a march, I'm going to hold my towel horizontally but then slightly twist down toward that leg. And then return that foot to the floor and do that, the same thing on the opposite leg. So my left leg comes up and I slightly twist toward that leg. It's almost like a crunch in the seated position for your abdominal muscles, while at the same time you're bending your leg up. So let's give that one a 
to try, we're going to alternate right leg to left leg and we'll go a little bit quicker. Towel is outstretched. Here we go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Stay on the right for 10, 9, 8, 7, So the 
Left heel is down, right toes are up. I'm gently reaching down toward that foot. Reaching and stretching. And come on up nice and easy. One more stretch here. So take that right ankle, see if you can cross it over the top of the left thigh. And in doing so, you're gonna feel a nice stretch on the outer hip of that right leg. Let the uh, knee kind of sink down toward the floor if you want a little bit of extra. Uh, extra stretch, you can gently push on the, the top of your thigh here. If this position is not accessible to you, then just take that ankle and cross it uh, over the other ankle down lower and let the knee open up toward the side that way. Nice deep breath. And let's switch sides. So left side, either cross over your thigh or cross down at your ankle. Feel that stretch in the outer hip. And sitting up nice and tall. Let's just hold this for about five more seconds. Three, two, and one. Uncross the legs. Let's do a little bit of deep breathing here. So inhale, raise your arms up to the ceiling. Exhale, push the air down toward the floor. Inhale, raise the air up. Exhale, push it down. One last time here. Inhale up. And exhale down. Just take a moment with your hands on your thighs, right back from where we started at the beginning of our workout today. Hands are on your thighs. Just close your eyes. Take it in. Soak in the exercise that you just did for your body. Even though it was pretty simple, you were sitting, you were just using a towel, you got your blood flowing, you stretched your muscles, you activated your muscles, you lengthened your spine, you expanded your posture. You actually just did a lot with your body in the last 25, 30-ish minutes. So great job. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope to see you again for one of our Saturday workouts. Um, our workouts are also available on our YouTube channel, which is Thrive PT and Wellness. And have a great day. I hope to see you again soon.